Genesis chapter 3 Now the serpent was more crafty than any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. Then the Lord God said to the woman, What is this you have done? And the woman said, The serpent deceived me, and I ate. She ate from the tree of which Lord God commanded not to eat. The Lord God said to the serpent, Because you have done this, cursed are you more than all cattle and more than every beast of the field. On your belly you will go, and dust you will eat all the days of your life. And I will put enmity between you and the woman and between your seed and her seed. He shall bruise you on the head, and you shall bruise him on the heel. Isaiah chapter 9 The people who walk in darkness will see a great light those who live in the land of darkness, the light will shine on them. You shall multiply the nation. You shall increase their joy. They will rejoice in your presence as with the gladness of harvest time, as they rejoice when they divide the spoils. For you shall break the oppressive yoke of their burden, and the staff on their shoulders, the rod of their oppressor, just as you did at the battle of Midian. For the trampling boot of battle and the bloodied garment of war will be burned as fuel for the fire. For a child will be born for us, a son will be given to us, and the government will be on his shoulders. He will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Eternal Father, Prince of Peace. There will be no end to the increase of his government or of peace on the throne of David and over his kingdom to establish it and to uphold it with justice and righteousness from now on and forevermore. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will accomplish this. Isaiah chapter 7 Therefore, the Lord himself will give you a sign. Behold, a virgin will be with child and bear a son, and she will call his name Emmanuel. God is with us. <laughs> 